Hello, this is Charles LeBlanc, the blogger, infamous blogger, or pain the butt blogger, or pain the ass blogger, or outspoken blogger, or the Fredericton Police Force number one enemy. Now, there's one thing that I wanted to know that always concerned me. We had a homeless guy named Scotty. Scotty was living in the rooming house. He was a panhandler. You know, he was one of those uh, menace of society, you know, that, that the snobs of the city would say, what those people, what, how come these people don't get, a, don't get a job? These idiots on my site, they gotta realize often that it's not that I wanna be on welfare. Yes, I'm a social assistant, but I'm not proud of it. That's the way it is. I had a job at the legislator, and then she said that I was a security risk. Moi, a security risk? Can you imagine that one? But anyway, going back to Scotty. Scotty, five years ago, I mean, he wasn't a big friend of mine, but I guess Scotty was involved in drugs, and he didn't look like he was on Dilaudid because he was pretty chubby. Maybe that's what I gotta do, be on Dilaudid, lose, lose, lose a few pounds. Nah, I'm a drunk and we'll, and we'll keep it that way, just like idea. Um, Scotty, yeah, my ADHD is working overtime this morning, jumping here and there. Anyway, Scotty disappeared off the face of the earth. Maybe nothing was said. <coughs> the last we heard about Scotty, he was heading toward Woodstock with two, two guys that bought him for a ride. As I always said, if these guys in there stop me with no uniform, hey Charles, you want to go for a ride? Uh, do you think I'm going to say, oh yeah, I love rides? No, no, no. I mean, there's certain rides you don't accept, especially when you're paying a butt blogger. But Scotty disappeared. Now, the family never asked the police to have a missing person report. A few people asked around, but the police, I mean, I'm sorry, I apologize. The racist cops never even asked the public if somebody seen Scotty. So, I mean, <laughs> these racist police officers of Fredericton, they go against the poor, they don't care about the poor, they give tickets to the poor for not wearing a helmet, and they attack people on the street if they're not wearing a bicycle with no helmet. What's going on? So, really, is it racism? Of course it's racism. People say, well, the poor is not a race. Bullshit! I'm sick and tired of having people say, oh, it's the elite. Uh, it's uh, discrimination. It's racism. You have natives, you have blacks, you have immigrants that turns around, they're part of be a people being a social assistant. Now, I, I said it before and I'll say it again. The less fortunate, it's a race. And these racist members of the Fredericton Police Force, I'm telling you, they better smart the hell out.